doctor visits, torrential downpours, iguanas, lots and lots of food, pool time. You're going to want to stick around for this edition of the Adventuring Five Costa Rica style. All right, a little lunch, some schoolwork while we wait for the monsoon. It's crazy. No, it's not a monsoon, it's just the rainy season. Down at uh, Playa de Jaco, right down from our little condo. It's playing in the sand, which got done playing in the water. So we got mom and dad. They are out in the ocean together. They made me watch these guys. Just joking. They're just having some fun out there, you know, being a couple. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's not always paradise at the beach. Little guy, madman, mad max, mad dog. Kind of fell ill, was complaining a little bit about his belly, and it kind of got worse over the over a few days, and the and the pain was starting to move from the middle down to towards his appendix. So we took him to the local clinic. They took a blood sample and a urine sample. All that came back negative as far as any immediate emergency need. So they told us to keep an eye on it and gave us a recommendation of another clinic in town uh, that could help us out if uh, anything got worse. All right, we're headed to the market. Go buy some kitty. veggies. Fruit. Fruit. Bread. Bread. Meat, maybe. Oh, uh, okay. We went down to the farmers market. We got some homemade fresh tomatoes. A couple things of apples. Maddox wanted pineapple. There's a bunch of vendors set up, and you just kind of go and pick what you want. Oh, uh, there's lots of fruit and vegetables. Uh, I think there was some like homemade bread and some bakery treats for all of this. Cost about $25, I think. With homemade tomatoes. With homemade tomatoes. <laughs> Ashley is going to have a bite of the homemade tamales we got from the market down the street in Jaco, Costa Rica. Mm. Really good. We are having a bite, oh, slippery little suckers. We're having a bite of the homemade tamale. Mm. Oh, good. Super good. It's not spicy, mm -hmm. but it has a really good kind of almost chipotle smoky flavor to it. It's really good. Uh, which is super good. I think good. I like it better than... I think like it has, Mexican I think it's tamales. pork, and there's rice. Beans. Beans, vegetables, veggies, Ew. tastes pretty dang good. <laughs> Even though Maddox was starting to feel better, the pain was still there and it kept going towards his appendix. So we just were being super cautious and went to another clinic in town. The doctor was super nice, very helpful, kind of walked us through some of the symptoms uh, that Maddox was going through and what it could be and kind of ruled out the appendix stuff. But we did a few more tests and Got an ultrasound just to rule everything out. All looked good. Doctor said he was good to go, that it was probably just a bacteria infection. Uh, so gave us some meds for that and sent us on the way. And he has been doing great ever since. What'd you get? A smoothie. What'd you get your smoothie for? For getting my, um... Your blood drawn? Yep. Yeah, you're a good boy at the doctor? Nice. All right, Kaylin and I are venturing out on our own. We're headed to the farmer's market to get some more piña y tamales. What do you think? It doesn't taste like coconut, but it's okay. It's good. It's hydrating. What do you think? I think it's pretty good. I think we did a good job on our first outing. What do you think? This coconut yeah? water is good. We got some... Bananas, 10 bananas. Piña. And another piña, another pineapple, because it's so good. Uh, eggs. Yeah, we got 18 eggs. And we also got coconut water. And coconut water to try. We got a little surf competition happening here. Beautiful day out. Ash is out there with the kids. Getting some waves. So we're eating at the beach. Nice little... Water never tasted so good. I'm grateful.
grateful that we get to be here and we get to be next to the ocean. I'm grateful for the sun and being at the beach. I'm grateful for being at the beach in the pool. I'm grateful for riding the waves into the shore. It's really fun. I'm grateful for all my family trying to speak Spanish. Here. What you got there? No. Passion fruit mojito. Really dangerous. Alright, Kayla, what do you have? <laughs> A mouthful of food? Mm -hmm. We got it. ceviche with smashed yeah. plantains. Yeah, fish ceviche. Yeah. Or we have chicken fingers over there. We have chicken fingers over here. And then we have a gigantic plate of nachos. All right, we're headed to the shops. We just ate some food. How was the food, guys? Super good. Oh, man, it was super good, really good, tasty food. Beachfront. And now we're headed to the shops to go check it out, get some ice cream. The beach is beautiful today. Great waves, blue water out. Wind's kicking up a little bit, so it's kicking the surf down just a little bit, but so far, so good. We're at Pops. Costa Rica's best ice cream since 1968. You're reading that from a sign. <laughs> I got a brownie dynamite kind of the best. What did you get? I got the strawberry ice cream. Nice. Or fruit ice cream. What about you? I got chocolate chip. 